Peace, infinite peace. Peace, my physical as well. Peace, peace. Yeah, I want to build on, add on about the message that I left saying that I feel on the verge of greatness. Doing my best to verbalize the feeling and the energy that I have. I'm looking at a lotus plant, one of my favorites. Uh, look the size of this leaf. So yeah, it all, it all stems from uh, a meeting that I had at school on, uh, I think, April, no, 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 yeah, 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 April 23rd. And if the principal was going through saying how more students are coming to the school and, you know, a lot of administrative stuff, you know, things of that nature. And um, some of the non-Chinese colleagues, they're a little worried. They try to self-project this fear that, you know, with the influx of uh, more uh, local students, perhaps their skills won't be needed. And then uh, one of them tried to project on me his fear, saying that there's no future. So I felt like one of them old, that old MC Breed uh, title, there's no future in your front. So I've always been the type where, when um, I, 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 I completely pick up on people's vibes and energy, and I can pick up on when people are trying to blood suck your energy consciously and subconsciously, you know? And I always get away from that, even with students, even with kids, you know what I mean? There's certain students that, you know, I'm professional, but, you know, I stay back from because, you know, that, that, that blood sucking mentality. So I've been spending a lot of time, you know, isolated at the school or self-isolation in the music room. And then working on my craft, getting the guitar right, you know? So while I'm in there, I got all this time to myself, to my own thoughts, and I don't be blood sucking myself. So while, while I'm in there, just this feeling of euphoria, you know, comes to me. And I reflect on my physical degree and my upcoming physical degree. I stay on those. And um, just reflected on my past history. And I noticed the pattern. Each time, you see, he, he should obey the, the, the traffic laws. It's still a red light. You know what I'm saying? But anyway, he, uh, uh, pardon me, he, uh, anything that I really put my mind to, I've done. I've accomplished that. And I'm gonna just going to continue to do that, you know? And I could just have this feeling that by me tapping more into me and my energy, any thought could become born, you know? It's like when um, I was 14, Knowledge Culture, I wanted to dunk a basketball, man. I seen that my man Eric Creighton, you know, he was dunking a basketball, so I did it. Anything that I put my mind to do, I could do. I wanted to come out here, you know, teach and work. I did that. So I'm feeling and seeing that my growth and development will continue to grow and develop because of me. It's like, it's inconceivable to me how I was when I was a swine eater, mystery believer, you know? But you know how that goes, you know what I mean? You know, we came out of that, you know, and I want to constant, constantly keep out of that. And um, pardon if it seems like I'm rambling, but I feel good. I feel real good, you know? I know now what I got to do. I know now the people to associate with and the people not to associate with. I could tell after I made my... Um, Constantly evolving evolution. I like to put these verbs out there. Evolving, growing, learning, sharing, caring. And not everybody's gonna go down that path. Not everybody's gonna choose themselves, you know? I remember back in the day, I would try, you know, with anything, I would try to share it to those, but sometimes you just can't cash those jewels of people. Nine times out of 10 out here, you know, they'll start the conversation off with something negative. 
right? That's the beauty of our culture. When we greet each other, what do we say? We say peace. We say peace. When we leave each other, what do we say? We say peace, right? So a lot of people who I come in contact with, it's the opposite. It's hello. And then after that, they get into a real hello vibration conversation. So I'm loving myself, you know? I got this far and I, I know and understand that this is just the beginning. This is just the tip, you know? No limits, like Master P said. I'm my biggest enemy. It ain't no devil, it ain't no this, ain't no that, ain't no white man, it ain't no Chinese man. Nah, it's self, you know? Word up, so I'm just gonna keep striving, man. Keep learning on these on my studies and growth and development because I got a lot to offer to myself and the world and the universe around me. Uh, right now, these are working hours. Really into the plants today. I prefer communicating with uh, plants. Peace, y'all. How y'all doing today? Or right now, getting that sunlight in. I'd rather communicate with them than a lot of adults because my communications with these plants over here is way better all right y'all peace 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 good to see y'all i'll see y'all at 4 30. so i'm heading back to the school my afternoon duty is to um walk the kids to the uh bus stop so now i'm walking back still half days uh, because of covid 19 they keep the kids only for a short amount of time uh, lesson time was decreased from normal time of like an hour wait a minute but yeah about 90 minute lessons to 20 minute lessons which I absolutely love because it's shorter I could get it everything in and that's that and so from now until 4 30 it's all yeah keen time and uh I'm ahead back and I guess I'll keep um this video rolling right now I'm in uh, Pat Hearn it's a uh, village area very rural which I like and I like the city area a lot of these um, homes are worth some money is that the countryside land is at a at a disadvantage out here Hong Kong is really small so yeah that's what I'm gonna do I've been happy man cuz you know when I'm at work in the past, you know, people gossiping and backbiting and never showing any gratitude for what they got, you know? So I don't got no time for that. I'd rather think about how and act out on how I can improve my physical, you know? Push-ups, sit-ups, pull-ups, and dips. Daily calisthenics will keep yourself fit, you know? That's what I'm about. Word. And then anybody who want to gravitate and um, build with me, you know, they're more than welcome to come inside the music room, which I'm about to go into. So, yeah, I'm feeling good. I, I still don't think I really express what the feeling that I have. It's kind of like, hmm, just about came to my mind, like, because I was reading um, a book about Run DMC. And like the supreme confidence that they had within themselves, you know, stems from uh, their father, uh, uh, the Simmons father, I forget his name. You know, he was like a real pioneer, civil rights leader. And um, so his sons, he had three boys, uh, Run, that other Simmons, I forget his name, man, uh, who, you know, ran Def Jam and another brother. So to even, see the core of the group a name like run run dmc you know back then it was names like treacherous three furious five mm, this is beautiful right here i'm gonna get a house like this similar to this oh look at that yo yes yes sir yes sir something like that this one is unoccupied yeah, this one, it's another beauty right here. This is like millions of dollars 
in U.S. money. This might be about two million U.S. That house right there. You know, it's located real close to the school, so it's probably like pin drop silence here at nighttime. During the daytime, you know, kind of chaotic, listening to all the kids yelling and running around. But um, yeah, just having that knowledge yourself, you know, and uh, knowing that sometimes you gotta just do for self, stay to self. It's better for your mental health. It builds your own wealth. So I'm back on the campus. And um, I'm gonna head to my room of isolation. I got the AC on, so when I arrive, it'll be okay. This is peace, man. Like the uh, gardeners have done an excellent job with the, developing the plant life here, and I love it. You know, because trees are mad important. They cut down, in the world, they cut down like 27,000 trees a day for toilet tissue. The devil's out of control with how he, you know, what, he, what he's doing with the planet. Actually, this past week was Green Week and was teaching the kids how to better uh, use their environment. So yeah, yeah, he, he, see that they're, they're the colleagues. They're over there running their mouth. But me, I come right on in here. I'm messing with these drums. I'm messing with the drums. This guitar. And that's it. I am for my physical peace.